welcome. Hi. Hi YouTube, it's Destiny, Lena, and we are Two Fam with another, another video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so today we're going to talk about how do we survive our marriage for so long. We're going to give you some tips and we're going to talk our own experience. Just scratch your ears with the bobby pin is the best sensation ever. <laughs> yes, oh crazy. my God. <laughs> That's how you survive. <laughs> That's how you survive. Okay, so for if you are new to our channel, please, please comment, like, and subscribe. And hit that little bell so you can be notified every time we post a video because we post videos every week, two times or three times a week. <laughs> anyway, so let's talk about us. 14 years of... Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about me. And me. Let's talk about all the good things and the things let's talk about, baby. <laughs> Salt and pepper okay. back in the day. Okay, so you see, <clears throat> that's number one. <laughs> that's number one. <laughs> don't you, don't you ever, ever get your relationship get bored. <laughs> because, let me tell you something. Number one rule in a marriage is actually community it's actually com stop it it's actually communication and should i change your name what name do you want to put me between us sophia because <laughs> <laughs> this have grown a lot during a couple of years okay Communication, first of all, is the key. You have to communicate what bothers you, what That's makes you happy. Because otherwise we don't know. And then routine. Routines are the things that kill marriage the most. We try to travel a lot because we are kids. So we try to travel a lot to have alone time. We try to have dates also in between. So when we here in New York City, we sometimes I just pick her up from work and I just say, let's go eat, let's go have dinner, let's go to the movie, out of nowhere, without planning it. Or sometimes she comes home and I have dinner ready for her, waiting, surf and all of that. I wake up with breakfast I want in the morning. I want me Saturday. Okay. I want me most. And then... Sometimes you want to kill your wife, you know, but unfortunately, oh my gosh, you, you cannot do me. that because then you're gonna be wifeless. She showed me in national TV public video on YouTube. So you are my witness that she showed me, okay? So this is what I'm going through with this woman that I consider her my wife by a legit paper, but look how she treat me. She choked <laughs> me, she don't feed me, you know. Oh really, who cooked for you today? Two hands. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me how you don't want to kill somebody like this. <laughs> anyway, no, let's be serious. Um, you have to put that little salt and pepper in between and in the middle of the sugar for you can have that great communication skill with your partner. Because remember, we're human beings, we're different person, we think different, we act different. And normally we can have things in common and other things we not have it in common because she have her own mentality and I have my own. But at the end of everything, we bonded together and whatever things she likes, I accomplish with that. Whatever things I like, she accomplish with that as well. Which is the next point, which is respect. You need to respect everybody's personality because everybody's different. And at the end of the day, the third one is compromising. You need one to thing compromise. that I don't like about couples that I think it's wrong. I see it in the past that you should always have your couple hundred percent back. If you're in front of other friends, whatever, and maybe yeah. your your partner is not right, 
you know, do not put her on the spot in front of the other people, like mm -hmm. saying no, that's not true, or whatever, mm -hmm. or that's not right. If your couple is is talking or having a conversation, you may, you can, you know, you can be by her side, you can stay quiet. If it's something that you want to share and give your opinion, it's okay, as long as you you are in the same page as your couple, but never go against your couple, your girlfriend, your you know, your mutual friend, whatever, your you significant know, other. Significant other. I don't think it's right. Because I'm gonna be honest because I have done it before. I'm not a liar. I'm very honest hundred percent. I seen that before and when that two couple leave I start thinking, Wow, that's we a relationship. Are they really getting along? Because this one was against her and in front of people I don't think that's right. If you wanna do it at home in closed door might as well to do it, it's fine. Everyone does it, no one's perfect. But in front of people, never. You should have your couples. You should have your partners back. 100%. There you go. And then also, um, like I said, uh, I'm gonna, this, this, this point that I'm gonna say right now is especially strictly for lesbian only. Because, lesbian or gay, because People tend to say, who's the guy? The last time I checked, there's no guy here. Because then nobody have nothing hanging in between her legs. You don't have no here. balls. So, you know, we both have a vagina. So we're both girls. So we're both women. And who asked period. that question? Even, even if you're not feminine, you're still a girl. Even if you're not, you know, you're still a woman. So we do, I cook. She wash the dishes. She cleaned the stove. She cook. I wash the dishes or I mop the floor. We try. We help each other. You know, it's not like she's going to do everything or I'm going to do everything. We both work. Exactly. It's not like I'm sitting down here and doing nothing. And even if I was sitting here, trust me, I would have been, been doing something. Not just laying down. Because I, anyway, I don't like to be laying down in bed. <laughs> but helping each other and having each other's back 100%. That's the key. That's the foundation of a marriage and a relationship. I'm not going to say that we're not going to argue. We do argue. We argue a lot. A lot. Almost every day. We fix it and we go to bed together. But we're girls. Oh, we lesbian girls, women, femme. That's it. So, but that's it. You know, we are women. So that thing, oh, I am like in heterosexual relationship where a man or a woman you see the men, the woman's is in charge of doing everything in the house and the men's is just sitting there watching TV with the control. Ain't not freaking that in my house. We do everything. We do laundry together. Oh, you're all... pulling my hair. <laughs> That's good. We do laundry together. We go food shopping. We was in BJ together. We always yeah. go so, together. Very that's weird. it. Damn, that's the key. Being universal. Universal means that you do everything. Universal. So we gotta do universal. everything. Universal. 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 Yo, she's universal. hilarious. So I'm telling you. And let me tell you something. It's not because she's in front of the camera. That's just how she is. It's true. You know. I'm gonna record a video when I go back to work. I'm gonna look individually. Oh, everybody's missing. She's on vacation right now, but everybody's missing. Everybody's texting her. That when she's coming back, they miss her because the story is dead without Miss Lena and this and that because of her bubbling. And in every store. It's, it's in every store. Like in Rich Hill, Chris County, Park Chester. They love me and popular. Oh, God. She you believe in back yourself. To the video. <laughs> believe. Yes. That's what it is. Being, being, when you go out with your best friend, that person that you call your best friend, you share supposedly everything with that person right and you do everything with that person so what your partner should be more in deep more in depth mean that that's the person that you really have to share everything with because at the end of the day that's the person who you're gonna be with well, that's the person you choose for your life to, for from to the be beginning, from the beginning that we got together, I gave her basically ownership of my account. I put her on my account, so we have joint account. I put her on my account. I put her in the. I have 
never had an account or have never had I mean there's no need for that like I said you know being responsible and being knowing that you really want to be let's be realistic she's not going nowhere you need her, honey. I, I was just gonna say that. Oh, no, no, I think I think faster, <laughs> honey. Okay, I had to split some tea out of my word, out of my mouth. You're not going nowhere, darling. So continue, continue talking. No, I'm gonna let you continue. Why I'm not going nowhere? Cause you're with me, darling. So you don't need nothing else. Don't get it twisted. Continue. How how you know that? I've been knowing that you've been with me 14 years. Hello. <laughs> Don't take nobody for granted though, but she's here and she's not going nowhere. So might as well, if you know that's the person you want to be and if you know that's the person you want to share your life with, fix the problem. Stop telling what's that problem and do what you're supposed to do, you know, and then after that, you're gonna feel the relief and then after that you're gonna know the difference because if that's the person that you marry that means that you marry for a reason and that means that you marry thinking that you are gonna be with that person forever I'm not saying that that's the case that's what we want but we don't know what could happen tomorrow tomorrow so we don't know couples like that have years and years you don't separating know. all of that tomorrow so don't know. tomorrow Oh, tomorrow, tomorrow, whoa, 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 tomorrow, you don't know, tomorrow. Continue. Can I continue now? Of course. As I was saying, you know, that's what you're supposed to do. Number one, communication. Number two, respect. Respect. Number three, Committed to each other. Commitment. Commitment. Number four, try to be fun. Cuatro. Cinco. Number five, sharing everything and fixing loyal to the problem. Loyalty is the key. Say. So that's, that's the reason why. Say. 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 And say number six. Say. 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 What's number six? Loyalty. Love each other deeply. <laughs> deeply, my friend, my lover, my wife. Deeply, deeply. Buongiorno, capisce? Entendite, italiani. Lovely. Entendite, listen, listen, listen italiani. how she speaks to me at night. Speak to them in Portuguese. My, I know. Speak to that in Portuguese. Todo bom, mas eu como está e todo bem. Mas como faz o dia hoje? Muito bem. Muito bom. A beleza. <laughs> tu um bom dia, só é tá bom. Vês? She's she's trilingual. <laughs> so we're gonna and live in six, six. There you go, you two. This is just. Another video showing you that it could be possible.